Alrighty, we are back with another solo leveling arise video and we are going to go ahead and check out the changes they made to the summer event, right? So for those who are unaware, um, what they practically did was make nerfs, I guess, to the summer event, making it a lot easier. I have not logged in yet. This is my first time logging in since. And so we are going to check it out to see whether or not it is a lot easier, whether it's still really difficult or whatnot, or what the case is going to be. Now, I will say, with an event like this, okay, and I really don't think that they should have even made it hard in the first place, because with an event like this, I typically like to think of these as, like, not really anything too difficult, if that makes sense, right? It's a cool event, it's a cool way to get a lot of high tier resources without being, like, you know, pay to win or whatnot, and I think for a lot of new players or just free-to-play players in general, this was an amazing event to do, and honestly, it's really fun. I actually enjoy the entirety of the event. Um, and everything is like I said, it's super fun, but I feel like they should have just made it to where, you know, it was something that all players can do unless you're like legit brand new, brand new, right? But I feel like even if you maybe started playing like a month ago, um, you're still working on your way and getting up story mode, artifacts and everything. I feel like they should have still made it easy enough to where every player can kind of do it. But that's just my personal opinion. Okay, so let's go ahead and check out the brand new boss summary crush uh, events. So I was actually managed to beat tier five. No problem. Or not no problem actually I actually did struggle a little bit so tier six was something that i was going to struggle on now let's go ahead and take a look at the power level to see what it currently is at so 427 i'm in the clear so that's good Eighty-seven thousand five hundred. oh my god so i saw someone say in my discord saying that you know the power level for this is now eighty-seven thousand five hundred. at first i went back and checked on chapter one I was like okay maybe they're confusing it with tier six easy mode eighty-seven thousand five hundred. i was like okay cool maybe they just misconfused it but no, it is actually 87,500 for the power level. That is insane. What? Wow. Okay, so free to play wise, I mean, yeah, I mean, if this is 87,500, then tier 10 should easily be doable for pretty much every free to play player, especially if you're playing since day one. Okay, I'm going to auto this and let's see how far we can go on this event. If I can get all 10, uh, all 10 stages done, then we're going to go ahead and do a multi at the end. But yeah, wow, they actually nerfed this event to hell and back. Okay. Even though it shows 87,500, it still could be difficult. So I'm going to leave it on auto. Let's see if my child doesn't like absolutely once out this guy. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 So yeah, obviously there's a gigantic change to the event now. I really don't think anyone is going to be complaining about this event. I will take that 400 gold or 400,000 gold. And then when it comes to the 1 million gold that we got, by the way, for everyone beating the event, I, I spent that in two minutes. <laughs> I spent that in two minutes just like working on artifacts and try, trying to swap artifacts from like different unit to different unit. I forgot to check the power level in this fight. Crap. Okay. So we're going to, this is now stage seven. So stage eight, uh, how many bars of health do you have now? Okay. So you have 45 bars of health on this one, but it's still obviously like really easy. Not really anything too crazy. Yeah. Wow. They actually nerfed this like to hell and back. No joke. Honestly, like I said, I, I do think this event, you know, maybe not necessarily as easy as it is now, but I still feel like it should not have been as hard as it was to begin with. Because again, with an event like this, I did the same thing. Okay, let me hop out of this fight because I want to see the power level recommendation for it. Um, but with, an, with a fight like this or an event like this, rather, you know, something that's not here all the time, something that's very limited, um, part of like, you know, a celebration, that being the Grand Summer Festival, then I do think it should have been something that, again, majority of players, you know, should have been able to do. But again, when it came to the um, pre-update, I guess rather, that's the best way of saying it, it was extremely difficult. Okay, so tier 8 is 160k power level. And in tier 9, tier 10, I imagine is probably like, what, 300k? Which I would say is still pretty doable, especially if you are free to play, especially if you've been playing since day one, you should easily be able to beat this. And I feel like even for those who started the game not too long ago, you should have no problem beating this because of the fact that it, there still is like 12 more days and everything. I feel like like if you just start now, maybe you won't be able to beat it. Maybe you won't be able to get to uh, stage 10, but I feel really confident saying that you should be able to, you know, get majority of the rewards, which is what should have been done in the first place, right? But yeah, just before the update, it was it was extremely, extremely difficult, like crazy, crazy stuff. I mean, this crocodile the thing was like, one tapping all my units was just one attacking. It was actually stupid on how broken o OP he was. Okay, so that's tier eight. Uh, so now tier nine, what is it? I honestly did not expect it to be this easy. So tier nine, what is the power level at? 218. Okay, so this is probably going to be 300,000, most likely, right? So tier nine, 
Okay, cool. I mean, again, I'll take it. And then we are going to go ahead and do a multi at the end. But yeah, just wanted to go ahead and record a video showing you guys in real time how easy this event is. Because um, like on a forum, they didn't actually specify. They just said that, oh yeah, nerfs are coming to the event, so don't worry about it. I wonder if they made any other changes to anything else. Uh, I'll have to double check. I don't think so, but we can go ahead and check after I finish up tier 10. But I think the only change was made to this event. Uh, I don't think anything else was touched. I'll be surprised if if it was. We can actually go check the Encore stages because maybe that went ahead and got updated. But I imagine it did not because uh, otherwise I think a lot of people will be freaking out in a good way. That is not really in a, in a bad way. Ooh, I'll take that 100%. And then tier 10, I'm expecting it to be 300k power level. But let's go ahead and see here. Uh, tier 10, 242. So not even 300,000. So in reality, all free to play players, you should be able to do this. This is very obtainable, especially if you do um, work on the easy mode of Workshop or Brilliant Light. Getting, you know, the curse sets and everything is going to be a big power increase for your account. So yeah, 242 is quite obtainable. I also need to swap out my um, my Chaw outfit and go for the different design. Because I have like 3k of the... Uh, uh what is it called not not the codex but the pretty much the materials needed to i guess get different alternative arts for the costumes i i love them by the way i just hope they do give out more going forward yeah the damage wise he's he's not really dishing out as crazy damage <laughs> honestly bro like it is such a massive world of difference like different as night and day the damage output that he's doing now in comparison to how he was just hours ago before before um reset happened oh my god Wow, 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 wow. What a what a big, big world of difference. Okay, let's go ahead and wrap this up. And that is GG's. Boom, well, let's take it. All right, so let's go do our free summon. Um, you, but you should be saving all your essence, by the way. Don't worry about my essence. I know it is not where it should be. Uh, I kind of been spending a lot of my essence recently. But yeah, just ignore that, okay? But let's go back and check everything else. Um, I wonder if they went ahead and changed the Encore and Instant Dungeon. So let's go take a look at that. So Encore fights now for tier 10. Um, okay, so still 555 with the, you know, high difficulty battle indication. And then, okay, so I don't think they changed this, which is good because they already made one change to it. But uh, let me go ahead and check instance just on the off chance they went ahead and changed this. I don't think they did. Yeah, 555. Okay, so that's still not bad. Oh, cool. I am working on tier 8. I could probably do tier 8, to be honest with you guys, if I get really, really lucky. But... For now, I am focusing on doing tier 7. But overall, again, not too bad. I really do think they shouldn't have made it as hard as it was to begin with, in my opinion. For an event like this, I feel like... Because your goal is to just encourage a lot of players to play it, right? But with it being as hard as it was, it's like a lot of players were not able to clear it. Even low spenders at that were not able to clear all of it. I feel like it should have been what it is now. Just so, you know, you have a lot of players playing the event and you have a lot of players getting all the high tier rewards. But... Anyways, they went ahead and made that change, so I am happy. No complaints on my end. Um, let's go and do one multi. Let's see if we can get lucky. Uh, if I pull the green one, it'll be A5. If I pull Elisio, it'll be A4. Uh, Mayland should be A1. And then Plume Sword will be A3. So any of these will be a fat W. Please, let's get lucky. Uh, of course not. Dude, my gotcha luck recently has been terrible. But luckily enough, I am guaranteed go gun he whenever he does drop. So... I am said the fest unit is guaranteed on my account, so no complaints there. But yeah, let me know how your account progression is going. Um, can we get a West Wind? This would be A5 West Wind for the win. No, it's one of the worst SR units in the entire game. That's fantastic. All right, on it there. Just want to go ahead and uh, show you guys a new update on how everything is. But yeah, let me know your thoughts. All right, take care. Peace.